I'm Christy Smith and I'm here with Abigail Spencer, our October Vanities. So you have an incredibly busy uh, dossier, I should say, very uh, a long list of projects you, you're doing. I can't even kind of really keep up. But the first one is Chasing Mavericks, which yeah. I'm most very excited about, which is why I am featuring Abigail. Mm -hmm. And that is a surfing movie. I mean, yeah. that's all basically I know about it is that it you know, stars Jerry Butler mm -hmm. uh, and yourself mm -hmm. and another actor who's a longboard champion, right? Is well, that the whole premise John, of it? Well, yeah, Johnny Weston um, is playing this incredible character named Jay Moriarty, who is a real person that my father, who is a famous surfer, right. five-time U.S. champion, knew. And he kind of started this whole movement, Live Like Jay. He was a kid who came from very meager means, did not have a father figure in his life. And Jerry plays Frosty Hessen, who literally comes in and kind of, to my characters, yes. like, do. She supports her husband in doing the right thing and training this boy on this really dangerous wave. And if you know surfers, it's like you can't keep a surfer from the wave, you just can't do it. So then he comes in, becomes a father figure, and trains him to surf Mavericks, which is the most dangerous wave on the planet. And now you're in your, in the middle of a television show, right mm -hmm. now shooting, yeah, yeah. just started. Oh, wow. What's it called? It's called Rectify. Rectify. Yeah, okay. Rectify. It's Sundance Channel's first scripted series, mm -hmm. and it, it centers on um, Daniel and Amantha Holden. They're a brother-sister relationship. Basically, the show starts with Daniel has been on death row for 20 years, you know, wrongly accused, uh, so my character believes, with every inch of her body, so much so that she committed her life to getting him off death row. And so, within a matter of moments, after 20 years of him being on death row, he gets released because of this whole DNA thing and, and we start the show like he's being released into society and, and my character is like this is the thing she's been working for right. and then and then it all happens it's oh, like when an good. alien's being yeah. dropped down on the yeah. planet you started writing yourself I so did this is the uh, thing I was reading, James Franco's Come On, mm -hmm. you have your own project that you've written, right? Yeah. And you are starring in. Mm -hmm. and yeah, James and I, we met, we did a movie last summer called Ahaz the Great and Powerful right. that's coming out in March. As we were talking, as we were working together, um, I just kind of gave him the one-liner. It's two people that meet through a wrong number phone call at the vortex of their lives and their paths get changed forever. And he was like, a movie about two people on the phone? I want to make that movie. Right. And I was like, yeah, you want to break the rules, don't you? Yeah. And he was like, yeah, I do. So uh, we've just been developing it. It's just such a pleasure to work with amazing artists. You know, that's what I'm just so grateful for right now. So great. Well, thank you so much for becoming part of our oh Vanity Fair family. Oh my gosh, thanks family. for having me.